I picked up this uh, Easter truck from Michael's. I believe it was 40 or 50% off. And I'm just taping down the hanger so that I can paint it and not worry about getting paint on the hanger. I started with Siren Song by Wise Owl. And I'm just forming my lines and where I want my truck to start and end. I'm taking a white chalk pencil and drawing out my tires and then filling that in with black by Wise Owl. Again, taking my chalk pencil and creating the window in the door. And I'm filling this in with white for now. And I'm just establishing uh, the details. I did a second coat with Siren Song. It's a really pretty um, blue. And I had all my second coats uh, filled in. So I found this stencil at Michael's by Martha Stewart. And they it was all bee themed. And I'm going to use the eggs that are in the back of the truck. And I'm going to make them beehives. This is Iron Oxide by Wise Owl. And I'm using a dabber. And these stencils were um, adhesive. So they... they we're able to stick on and I'm using a dabber from the Dollar Tree and using a light amount of paint to fill in the beehive. And I'm gonna take the uh, far right egg in the back of the truck and I'm gonna make that a second beehive. Now I'm going to take some black and fill in the opening to the beehive. You can use some tape to help with your, your lines. And I'm filling in the white part of the beehive with black. And I'm going to do the same thing on the second beehive. If you're in need of some art brushes, we do have a set on chalkitupfancy.com and all the paint you can find at chalkitupfancy.com. So the stencil set had a, uh, a flower. I believe it's a sunflower. I'm not gonna worry about what kind of flower it is. I painted this in the um, Dijon by Wise Owl. And then the center of the flower, I'm going back with the um, chocolate. I'm taking some more Dijon and I'm making hay in the bottom portion underneath the hives and kind of flowing into the bed of the truck by just creating these upside down V's and X's. And I just kept building this up till I got right underneath the beehives.
Now I'm taking a dabber and our silver metallic paint and creating the center of the tire. And I also filled in the windshield with the same silver. Our metallics can be found at chocolateoffancy.com. I'm gonna bring this hay down a little bit further. I'm gonna put some white dots in the center of my flower to look like the seeds of the flower. I'm taking the silver metallic and making a door handle and a bumper in the front and the back of the pickup. I'm gonna take a second flower, and this one I'm gonna pull the color of the truck, uh, the siren song, and I'm gonna use a dabber with this particular flower. I'm gonna fill the center in again with the chocolate. and some white in the center of that flower as well. I'm gonna do some squiggly lines in the glass and I'm gonna start outlining the truck with some white lines in the tire. This just gives your truck some dimension and some movement. Guys, this is not perfect. This is just fun. You can do a lot with stencils. You can create art with uh, using stencils. And here we took this Easter truck and kind of made it something different than what it was supposed to be. Now I'm just taking some dry brush of the white through the truck. Now I had this Lemon Farm stencil with a pickup truck on it, and I took the open daily and put it on the door of my pickup truck to kind of top everything off. I think this came out really cute. I really hope you enjoyed this video. For other tutorials, go check us out on YouTube. You can now watch all our videos at chocolateoffancy.com for any paint products, tissue paper, transfers, and now our mesh stencils, chocolateoffancy.com.